You probably have watched business series and want to sound intelligent like the candidates there. It's pretty simple. They speak numbers, decimals and percentages a lot. You can find our videos about decimal numbers for your stepping stone. So let's move forward to conversion between decimal and percentage. Let's say we have this unusual monopoly game where your money is in decimal number, but the properties are in percentage. Take $0.47 for example. How can you tell the amount of dollars that you have in percentage? There are some different ways to know it. In the first method, you must follow these steps. Number one, convert to a fraction by using the thumb rule. Number two, multiply by 100 and write it as a percentage. We will use the thumb rule of decimal numbers here. The decimal point is placed at a specific position exactly to the right of the unit position of the whole number. Once you remove the decimal, the number will be divided by powers of 10 equal to the number of spaces after the decimal point counting from the left. Since we need to change this decimal into fraction, we will remove the decimal point and divide it by powers of 10 that are equal to the number of spaces after the decimal point. 0 0.47 equals 47 divided by 10 squared equaling 47 divided by 100. Next, multiplying the fraction by 100 and writing the answer as a percentage which is equal to 47%. And there you have it. Using a shorter method, we could directly multiply 0 0.47 with 100 to yield 47%. We can do the conversion by simply moving the decimal point two units to the right, and here we get the same answer as before. Now, try it with other fake money, $1.32. We need to convert it into a fraction first using the previous thumb rule. Now, let's move on to step number two. Multiply this fraction by 100 and write the answer as a percentage. The answer is 132%. Now, let's learn about the reverse process, converting percentage to decimal. You obtained an 84% mark for the business task. How do you know that you are qualified enough to continue the process if the passing grade is 0.75? You can express this percentage into a fraction first. In mathematics, percentage is a number or ratio expressed as a fraction of 100. Percentage means out of 100. So, 84% equals 84 out of 100. It means that to convert it into decimal, we can directly use a long division method of dividing 84 by 100 until the zero remainder is obtained. It gives us 0 0.84, but this method costs us a longer time. Here we'll try a faster trick. So, to convert the fraction to a decimal number, we can use the same thumb rule as before, but we have to use the rule in reverse. Look at the fraction in question that is 84 out of 100. This fraction has 100 in the denominator, that is 10 to the power 2. To convert the fraction to decimals, we remove the denominator and put a decimal point counting from the right of the whole number. The index of 10 is 2, so we put the decimal two spaces from the right. Therefore, the answer will be 0 0.84. If you remember the rule, you can easily do these conversions without writing anything down. How great is that? We hope you enjoyed learning about the decimals and percentages. Keep practicing and make mistakes. Happy learning!